day 17 so we're getting down to the wire Christmas is next week so today we're gonna make a mess so today we're wrapping Christmas presents so I have these I hope I even have enough wrapping paper for all the ones I need to wrap especially this one for Shayna because it's huge and it's gonna take a lot of wrapping paper it's going to be really awkward to wrap. I'm trying to use up all this wrapping paper from the last couple of years so the next year we can just buy new wrapping paper and it'll be awesome. So I won't show you everything I'm wrapping for Shayna because one, I don't want her to have to not watch two videos two days in a row and two, you'll see it all when we open presents on Christmas Eve. So, so... What I'm wrapping today, mainly I'm just wrapping Matt's presents today because they're the only ones I have. So I got him, I haven't looked at this yet, I don't know, I hope he likes it. I think I went with the wrong color shirt. So I got him this Skyrim Detected shirt. Because when you're sneaking, 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 the eye closes and then if someone sees you, it opens and it's, yeah, you're detected. So like when people look at you, you're detected. So I really hope he likes it. I thought it was a cool idea, but now I'm thinking maybe I should have gotten it on a gray background. Ooh. Also, I am wrapping this for him. I'm really excited I got him this. Because he loves butterfly knives. And I got him this cool... Oh, I haven't opened this yet either. Okay. He told me how to do this. Whoops. Oh, it's not very loose. Not very loose at all. Hmm. Maybe he'll have to loosen it up a little bit. So yeah. And then lastly, I got him this. The writing, writing prompts journal. I thought that might be fun for him because he's a writer. So, yeah, I thought that might be a fun little thing for him to have. All right, let's get wrapping. presents are wrapped. I still have a few more to do, but I have some other stuff I need to take care of, like in the next few minutes. I need to leave and go do some stuff. Um, I, th I have one more present for Shayna that I need to make before I can wrap it, and then I feel like I should be getting Matt more stuff because I have this feeling that he got me more than I got him, and like he even snuck something into my stocking this morning. 
So now I have to find stuff for his stocking. <sighs> At least we have another week, right? Um, so I thought I would show you guys our Christmas card that we're sending out to um, mainly just family. Um, but since I don't have all of your guys' addresses, I'll show it to you so you can see it. Isn't it cute? I really like how it turned out. The night that we took those pictures was a disaster because, um, like, trying to take pictures and capture the lights with no flash, it was just, it was, it was, yeah, <laughs> it was a disaster. Because Matt does not like to be photographed, so he was all fidgety, and if you move it all, the camera picks that up and everything blurs, and yeah, it's just not good. <laughs> so, yeah, so I think I'm going to go print out some more Christmas cards and pick up a few items. Tomorrow's payday, and it's like, I have to wait until payday to get, like, the big gifts, but... <sighs> oh well. That's that's how it goes, I guess, right? Alright, thank you guys. Um, I hope you're enjoying Vlogmas so far. I know I I am. I definitely My phone rang. Oh. Is it Shayna? It is Shayna. <laughs> anyway, so um yeah. So Vlogmas has been incredibly time consuming, like I <laughs> Even I was um, editing the Vlogmas for yesterday and Matt came into the studio he's like, you're so busy these days. It feels like I have to schedule time with you. It's like, <laughs> he was exaggerating very much. But um, it's like Vlogmas is very time consuming, but it's been so much fun. I love it. I definitely want to do this next year. So hopefully you guys have been enjoying it too. In front of you, Star Wars nerds out there. Um, today, Matt and I are doing the Machete Marathon for Star Wars. Um, we just finished A New Hope. He's gonna go catch some sleep because he worked all night and then we're gonna pick it back up tonight when he wakes up. Now if you don't know, the Machete Marathon method for watching Star Wars is you watch A New Hope and my personal favorite, Empire Strikes Back. And then you watch Attack of the Clones and <laughs> Revenge of the Sith. And then you watch Return of the Jedi. So you don't have to deal with episode one at all, which is awesome. And then by the time you get to the end of Empire Strikes Back, you watch Attack of the Clones and Revenge of the Sith like flashbacks. And then it brings you back to Return of the Jedi to finish out the series. So, I don't know what to expect for Force Awakens. The trailer really tells you nothing. Like, I'm actually, Matt and I actually agreed on this. Um, I'm more excited to rewatch the old movies and go see the new one just because the trailer does not make the movie seem that interesting at all. I get that it's a new movie, there hasn't been a new one for 12 years. <laughs> um, but it just, I hope. The movie is good. I want it to be good. Um, it looks like some of it could be really good, but I still don't know quite what I'm watching. I don't know what it's about. I don't know. Yeah, it's just, it's, the trailer just lends nothing, in my opinion. So, I'm excited to see it, but I think I'm more excited to rewatch the old movies, especially Empire Strikes Back. So, hopefully, you guys, if you love Star Wars, um, get to go see Force Awakens and hopefully you guys get to have a little marathon too because what's a new release movie without watching all the predecessors in a marathon? Now that's it. I just forgot I wanted to talk about Star Wars. So, of course my favorite Star Wars character is a bad guy. Yeah, Darth Maul. He's my favorite. After that would be Obi-Wan Kenobi. Love Obi-Wan Kenobi. Um, so if you guys have a favorite Star Wars character, you should list them down in the comments below. Um, and I'm talking old, mid, mid-old, mid-new, and the new series, if you've seen it or you know a little more about it, who is your favorite Star Wars character? And probably after Darth Maul, it'd have to be R2-D2. 
because he's just so freaking cute and sassy. And then probably Han Solo. And, and then the Ewoks. Dub, dub.